your fellow JCI members, all protocols observed. We're on a mission where leading is our duty. And I want to congratulate you on your journey on leadership. You, who are a leader by your position, having a duty to serve and lead by example, be the one whom to follow. And you, who already took some steps on the leadership path, got out of your comfort zone and said yes to development opportunities. You, who just joined the organization that aims to be the leading global network of enterprising young leaders, wanting to grow with a can-do attitude. And you, sitting in the audience, thinking, she's not talking about me, I'm not a leader. Believe me, yes, you are. It all can start today. There's something that unites us all leaders, this responsibility of duty, how we want to take care of ourselves, each other, community around us, our nation, this planet. It calls for good, sustainable leadership, the skill we can master in JCI while attending masterclasses, becoming global change makers, communicators, entrepreneurs, and networkers. Even without the title, you can practice and learn. And actually, this world would have so much better leaders if they all had had a chance to practice and learn before becoming a leader. Uh, starting from leading yourself, listen to the others, tell your ideas, take action, be trustworthy and give recognition. Suddenly, you might notice you already started climbing the leadership ladder. The world is not today the same that it was two years ago. If you think about the leaders we had in JCI past two years, someone from outside might say they didn't succeed or at least they didn't reach the goals from the plan of action. Luckily, that's not the only measurement. Like diamonds, true leaders are born and developed under pressure. And the purpose of JCI is to develop leaders for a changing world. This leadership school, spiced with a worldwide pandemic, is something totally unexpected, and no plans were made to face those challenges. But our leaders did act. They changed the way to work. They collected their teams and responded to the chaos by setting up projects to help, support, and solve the problems without anyone asking. They had the mindset of taking responsibility, carrying their duty. And that's how JCI Rice saw the sunlight. And anyone, I mean, anyone can be the leader to do the same tomorrow. So once more, I want to congratulate you on your leadership yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Thank you. Merci beaucoup. Gracias. Arigatou gozaimasu.